Hey guys, welcome to the review and t today I really just want to be a quick little announcement. It's uh, something that we're going to have in the next 24 hours, exactly, and uh, that's going to be the Intergalactic Rune Rumble. We've had this in the past, so it's nothing really new to the community. It is something maybe some of you guys might want to have the opportunity to get, but these are some of the things just so you can review of it and prepare for the event that's coming out. So these are the rewards you could receive. You definitely want to get the gamma runes because those are the ones that are harder to obtain and you want to get as high as you can because then they can get guaranteed uh, gamma runes and the alpha and the beta runes are a little bit higher as well. So this is going to help you overall improve your overall characters on especially the top five that you're trying to work with with every little squad whether it's just the uh, frozen squad or your downtown heroes or your downtown villains things like that so in this particular event you're going to need downtown heroes and you need to make sure that you level them up at least three of the uh, downtown heroes are star three uh, that is required and then at the same time it progressively gets higher and higher so you need to get four uh, four of them with star four then five with star five and so on and so on so you want to work on getting as many downtown heroes as you could possibly get for this particular upcoming event and these are the list of of characters that are available but the downtown heroes that you need so here's some of the things that i think will be useful i want to go into basically just what are the best farmable downtown heroes if you're just starting off or you're still trying to figure out what is the best course of action to get into the least play this event because you may not have enough downtown heroes to get there but you really want to get advantage take advantage of this before the event closes these are just some of the quick farmable ones not the best ones but they are uh not all of them are the best but they are ones that are easier to obtain the tokens so you can at least get them to star four uh, or three just so you can at least play the first event so here's all the list of downtown heroes for me personally the best two to get off the bat and that's probably when you start off the game you're probably working on it anyways is not him because he's on an event <laughs> is sully and buzz lightyear these two are very easy to obtain you can get them in the i believe the grand camp not grand campaign the villain campaign and you'll be able to farm them fairly fairly easy and you can get them to at least four stars so that you can at least do first two events and that will help you obtain more alpha and beta runes so you really want to work on these two particularly the next one that would be equally farm mobile to get is elastigirl now elastigirl just got recently added into the <coughs> Uh, campaigns so you can see here she's on the villain campaign on 4d so she is easily a farmable to some degree you just have to spend the time to do it hopefully you get enough to get a tokens so hopefully you have those tokens available in the chance of and you can get her at least a star three when you are playing uh, the next one that is equally easy but somewhat hard to get just because the number of tokens you need and i haven't unlocked her myself but she is definitely a good character to have i've played against several type of players that have, have unlocked her and used her and that's definitely judy hop judy hop is very easy to obtain the way i do or did it i haven't unlocked it and i'll make a separate video for that but what i did is now it's available on the exchange so what i did is i would actually use my battle tokens or tournament exchange tokens and i would unlock her from here now there are some other characters that are equally easy to purchase through these exchanges and that way you can build it up another one that i was going to talk about is anger anger is definitely another character you really want to use he's very um, useful because he does have a cleansing effect when he brought halfway of his health is removed he's able to put out damage to a significant amount to the enemy team all players on the enemy team so this definitely helps out his pizza little throw um, you ruined pizza type of special it actually helps out also with an area effect so you definitely want to use him to help lower down every character's uh, hp so that you can finish it off so again my top five farmable easy characters to get would be judy hops sully 
Buzz Lightyear, Anger, and Elastigirl. Those are the four that are easily obtainable to get. Now, if you're asking why not the other two people primal, well, here's the thing. So, the Ian and Barley you can't get unless you have the event. Frozone you can't get unless you have the event. Uh, Dark Green Duck, you can get him, but the thing is, I believe, if I remember right, he starts at 80 tokens, and you have to, the easiest way, or the way I did it, was doing off the dailies, and you had to do the daily events, so it's going to take too long for you to even try to unlock him. And also, uh, Jesse, yes, you can get Jesse from an event, but not this one. Actually, this rune one will have a package one if you really want to purchase it. I'll show you again what it is, but the all the Incredibles except for Elastigirl are only available on the event. So most of these characters are only event characters. Woody, the same thing. So you can't get them from. So and then these that I haven't unlocked, yes, you can get them, but you have to get to high levels of the campaign in order for you to even try to get this. So not easily farmable. So the five that I would suggest is going for those. So anyways, um, one last thing just so you, you can see. They will have some packages here that's going to be able to use for the event actually i'll just go right here so they will have a downtown heroes packet which will allow you to get mr scrooge and uh, you also get jesse you should get the tron girl and you also get elastic girl so these are some things you can get but i wanted to give you guys a heads up anyways thanks so much guys for watching i really appreciate you taking the time hit that like and subscribe button below if there's any new information you'd like me to put out let me know please join my facebook page as well as my twitter and that way i could communicate with you so thanks so much guys have a wonderful night bye bye